Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We're going to be breaking down the latest news around the NFL. Before we get started, though, please drop a quick like and a sub on today's video. That would really help my channel grow. I'd really appreciate that. With that said, let's dive right into the video, and I hope you enjoy. So now we're going to see Roger Saffold uh, signing with the Buffalo Bills on what looks to be a two-year deal. A uh, solid veteran guard uh, of the Titans uh, moving to Buffalo now. Uh, I mean, two sacks allowed last year on 853 snaps. Uh, the year before, played 872 snaps. So he's had a little bit of injury concerns over the past couple of years, but has always been an above-average Pro Bowl-type guard. I don't know if he's still at that point in his career, um, just because you know he's he's on the older side. I don't I forget how old exactly he is. Let me just pull that up. Uh, just here in a sec. Yeah, he's entering his age 34 season, but he was he was a he was a Pro Bowler last year, um, and I really like this move for Buffalo. Buffalo for the past couple of years has had a solid offensive line. Don't get me wrong, they haven't had a bad offensive line, but they've been you know maybe a guard or a tackle away at times uh, from having a really like a really elite offensive line. And I don't know if they'll have an elite offensive line next year, but you know with guys like uh, with 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 Roger Saffold, they they brought back Mitch Morse. Um, obviously, uh, they, they have, uh, why is the left tackle escaping my, my brain, but he's, he's good. Um, and their, their off the line is coming together and it's, it's really nice. Um, so I think bringing a guy like Saffold in is just going to add, uh, a pro bowl type player to an off the line. That's going to need some run support. Uh, definitely. He brings that to the table. Uh, Deion Dawkins, that's what I was thinking of. Uh, but you know, the, the left side of the off the line is going to be pretty good. And Cody Ford, honestly, Underrated player, not too great, but he's he's on the rise, I think. Um, so I really like this move, getting Saffold as a guard uh, to really help out this offensive line and, and really help out this offense in general in Buffalo. That's been really good over the past few years, but adding a legit Pro Bowl-type guard to the mix is really going to help. And with that said, that's pretty much going to end the video for today. Did you agree with my analysis? Why or why not? Leave your comments and thoughts in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Also, if you're new around here, please drop a like and a sub on today's video. I'd really appreciate that. And with that said, I hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, see ya.